starts this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. Hurts and the Eagles come up here first and 10 at the 34. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. His throw incomplete. Charles already trailing by touchdown early. This offense, how imperative is it for them to get points out of this drive? Well, they feel like they have to go ahead and match because of what was already on the board against their defense. But I think even more so, he's going to three and out. You might be able to stay on the field for a little while. Let your defense catch their breath a little bit, even if you don't score any points. Two yards, the loss, and now third and 12. I thought he did a nice job there setting an edge and make sure nothing could get to the outside. But he decided that wasn't enough for him. Worked his way back inside and made the tackle on the ball carrier. And that's out to the flat for Smith. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. On first down, Hurts. He'll get this into the hands of Swift once again. And he'll be taken down at the 44-yard line. Hurts sets up to throw it. Flush to his right. And he'll go out of bounds after taking that little further down inside the 40. Hurts dangerous when he runs that football. He's got a first. I think he had eyes on that run the whole time. Good anticipation because it seemed to me he waited for the coverage to get drawn away and then had the easy scamper out of bounds to get the short yardage first down. And he's going to get this inside the 30. Counting down to the midway point in quarter one. On first and 10, it's Hurts. He's going to get that to Swift underneath. That was play number seven on this drive, and it got him seven yards. Here's second and three. Back to the running game with Swift. And he'll go down here at the 12-yard line. And now a timeout called by the Cowboys' defense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. From down at the 12, it's first and 10. Throwing his hurts. Eluding the pressure. And he'll take it into the end zone for an Eagles touchdown. Jalen Hurts, a 12-yard touchdown run. And the Eagles respond to that opening drive touchdown with one of their own. That's a really good decision right there outside of the pocket. You've got to know the right time to shift from pass to the runner. He was looking and looking. Nothing there. You almost feel the brainwaves firing as he calculates. I think I can win a race to the pylon. And he turns out to be right. Touchdown. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. Sheds off the tackle. And able to get this out to the 25. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. It's going to be pretty tough for them to match their efficiency, Charles, with that last possession, needing only the one play to find the end zone on the rushing touchdown. Yeah, they got that together collectively. Didn't have a total defense. Although they get a technical He gets all the credit. So well, the only thing stops him is running into the goal post in the back of the end zone. First down, Prescott. Over the middle, holding the runner. And he'll get this move down the other 20 yard line, just shy of the 20. A first down throw for Prescott. Another in the CD lane, and he's got it. And he'll only get him down, but he does reach the foul. He's been a one-man wrecking crew these last couple of plays. This time, 18 more and a first down. They'll run with Pollard.
So after the touchdown, Aubrey now to kick this one away. And this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. They'll throw on first down with Hurts. They'll try and set up the screen to Swift. And he'll go down just shy of the 25 the 24 yard line. Hurts. Forced out to his left. And he'll get nothing there. Stops right at the line as that will wind us down to the end of this first quarter. Here's third and seven. They'll set up to throw. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and ten at the 48-yard line. Now a toss left side into the hands of his tight end. Down. He'll drop to throw it. He'll drop this one off to Swift. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. Second down, here's Jalen Hurts. And this one's incomplete. Too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. This is certainly a team that is proven that likes to target its backs through the air and defensively. They were aware of that and certainly were prepared on that throw. Again, he'll drop the throw. Dancing to his left. And this effort won't be enough as they rally up the stack of a couple of yards short. The offense staying out. They're going to go on fourth and two. And he gives himself up, but not before he gets the conversion. The Cowboys going to use their second timeout now. That's their second, so they'll have one remaining here in this second quarter. We'll be right back. Looking to throw. And he is going to go down. Back at the 11 yard line. Osa Diggy Zawa. Able to drop him for a loss of four from his defensive tackle spot. So they get pushed back to the 11, and here's second and goal. Here's a quick throw caught by Smith. A touchdown saving tackle there. Now it's third and goal. We've hit the two-minute mark in the second quarter. 14 to 7. Well, they held him out on second down, and now here's third and goal. Oh, the sneak gets hurt. And I don't think he got there. No, they stop him right where it all started. Only a few inches needed on the sneak. He didn't get it, and now it's fourth down. So this will be blown dead, and it'll come back to the spot of the fumble. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Well, this offense looks like they have a little extra pep in their step as they take the field here for drive number three, because remember, Charles drives one and two. Both ended in the end zone. 
Yeah, and right now they've just got to be careful not to lean into overconfidence because every drive has a life of its own. But I like the way that they've started, the way that they're going about doing it. And Holly Burles in, running to Spains. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. And they're going to speed things up here. And Prescott looks to throw on first. That is caught by Williams. For their third and final timeout as they get the stoppage with just under 50 seconds remaining in half number one. They'll go with Pollard here on first down. Down to about the 45. Second and six. Prescott down. And he moves complete. That's Lamb. And he has another first down. So he's going to hold down to the Eagles' 25 yard line. Now flags will come in. I think this one's going to be on the defense for Jumper. And that'll be a free five yards for the offense. Just like a tennis match, that's just an unforced error. Stay alert. Don't jump early and give them free yardage. Now Dak is going to mix it up. From the red zone now, Prescott. Swinging this out to Pollard. And the out is taking it just shy of the 10 at the end of the trip. It's a nine-yard gain, and it'll keep the drive moving. And a good quarterback facing zone coverage if he has just a little bit of time to survey the scene, that's what's going to happen. No doubt about it. If there's no pressure, he's going to continue to pick them apart because he'll have all that time to find someone open downfield. You can only cover for so long. So maybe they want to go to a zone blitz scheme, get a little bit more pressure. Remember when Carolina did that against Denver? They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with an interception in that game in Super Bowl 50. Maybe some sort of scheme like that to try and get more pressure on the passer. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. And we welcome you back live now inside the booth alongside Charles Davis. Our Brandon Gordon set and ready to rock for the third quarter. A one touchdown ball game, 14-7. Our scores, we get back at it on EA Sports. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. Yeah, he'll be out of bounds, just shy of the 30, right about the 29. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. Charles, it'll be interesting to see what adjustments this offense made in the locker room. Haven't really been able to get anything going the offense. They've virtually nothing in the ground attack either. So certainly something has to change here in quarter three. And I'm pretty sure their friends from the defensive side of the ball told them exactly that because those guys, the stop troops, they've been playing pretty well. They've kept them around in this game. Now they got some time. The game struggled in the first half. Opposition knows how to focus on defending the pass here. They've got to re energize that ground game and maybe open things up for a comeback here in this half. Here's Hurts to throw. And incomplete on the deep ball. Going to the second half now. This is an offense that continues to struggle to sustain the ground. Looks like they're just totally out of sync whether they're running the ball or passing the ball like we saw there. I don't know, the rhythm seems off. They're going on fourth down with Hurts. And it's incomplete. They cannot 